Hello, hello. Are we live? Are we live? Let me refresh. I just want to see how we're doing. It says that we're in excellent con I mean connection. So let, let's see. Refresh. Okay, yeah, we're good. And then now let me pull this up over here. Ooh, I can do it. You know, sometimes I struggle, even though I've been streaming for a while. It's always still a struggle. Uh, uh, where'd I put this? I guess there. And then this can stay there. Okay, we're good. All right. Here we go. But I wanted to come back to play We Happy Few since this game is perhaps one of my favorite games of all time. I very much enjoyed the atmosphere of it. I completed it like a few years ago. But I want to come back to it and try to complete everything in the game just because it's so fun. And then because I've heard that they've addressed some of the bugs that I encountered a while ago. And it really impacted the story. But we'll see how it is now with all the, the updates. Begin. But I want to get... I want to come back to this game just because it's so fun. It's very fun. The story is so interesting. I'm a big fan of this kind of atmosphere, this kind of world... These, like, what, like, dystopian societies, is that what it's called? Let's press space to continue. I also lowered the volume for all the music in this game, even though the fake, the fake music, or the fake band that they have in this game, uh, the make-believes, I really wish they were a real band. They are so good in this game, that band. The music that they made for this didn't have to go so hard. Yeah, I was very upset when I found out that the that the band wasn't real. They were just a make believe fan. I mean band. Oh heavens no. I'm trying to see my connection on the side and it shows that we're not doing too hot. Oh. I'll have to see God. in a little bit. Friday, 9th, October, 1964. He's got to pop a pill to forget everything. The Hastings brother wins Scrap Gathering Prize. Ooh. Hold on. I want to check real quick how the, the stream is doing on this end over here. Ooh. Wait, is it doing good? Yeah, okay. I'm just losing my mind, I guess. Yeah, okay. I'm just losing my mind, I guess. <laughs> I had to hear that on my own side again. Wait, 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 wait. Here we go. Okay, here we go. Let's continue. Oh, uh, but with, the, with the, the joy, we'll remember right now. We're not going to take it. We're going to continue our work. We don't need no medications. Percy. Percy. Percy, our brother. Oh yeah, Percival. The brothers won in collecting scrap. Like this is like after the war, isn't it? What have you been up to? No one's seen you for hours. Oh. Nose to the grindstone. After like World War II. Then why haven't I heard a single whoosh through the door since ten o'clock? Did you forget we're having Deirdre's birthday party? Oh. We've got a pinata. Right. Brilliant. Of course. Have you forgotten your job? So I think that's like a, a job that they had it's after the war was metal well, scrap. On, Finish up. Collecting metal scrap. <laughs> a few more pages. I, I know you're very busy. Then don't take too long to finish. We the 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 smile on her face. The power cell's empty. Well, what will you do? Probably replace it or recharge it. Oh, I have no power. How do I get up? Tell me how to get up. No, how do I get up, guys? Oh, bruh. Just E. Uh, Arthur Hastings, employee of the year, Department of Archives, Recycling and Printing, City of Wellington Wells. 
Oh, it's right here. Power cell. Cool. I can sit. It can't be this hard to finish up a day's <clears> work. <throat> Gosh, my voice. Wait, who are you again? Um, small table. Nothing in there. Dang, our office is clean. I love what you've done with your office. It's so homey. Is that a a pit bull? No, it's a bulldog with a bird in its jaws. Is that supposed to be like is that an eagle? Is I don't know what that's supposed to represent, but Do you have any it's an English bulldog. I'm going. Oh wait, they're gonna yell at me again. Wellington Wells, Imposterum cum gaudio. I don't know Latin, so I don't know what that says. Okay, how do I sit down? There you go. Yeah, I played this game last time on on Xbox like years ago, so it'll be a bit different. All right, restore. <clears throat> what are we going to do, Arthur? We're brothers. We'll look out for this scrap will be, will be metal down to be used to support the war effort against the Soviet Union. Oh, so now it's a... Oh, no, yeah, this is... This is around World War II. Oh, gosh. I had to reposition, reposition myself. Yeah, June 4th, 1947. Uh, Percival and Arthur Hastings were the surprise winners of the scrap drive. Arthur told the judges that his brother has a photographic memory. Percy knew exactly where all the old cars and prams and things were in the Garden District. Percival himself rarely speaks to strangers, apparently. The scrap will be, will be melted down to be used to support the war effort against the Soviet Union, which is, by all reports, going splendidly. The brothers brought in a record of 1,654 pounds of scrap steel, winning them a 50, was that pounds, victory against communism bond. The second prize went to Alan Unwin, <laughs> who brought in 315 pounds. Unwin, dude didn't win. Okay, buy your victory against communism bond, save now and rejoice later. So, the way I think this works is that we're supposed to pass down, oh, well, censor the negative news, like the bad news. Wait, hold on. I got to fix something on the video. There we go. Whoa, 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 whoa. Wait, what am I doing now? There we go. Now we're back. Yeah, we gotta we gotta like censor the bad news and keep in the good news. So it's kind of like George Orwell's 1984. If you guys have read that book, it's a very good book. I read it in high school a few years ago. One of the best books I've ever read. I think that's what got me into enjoying these kinds of worlds, these fictional worlds. But this one will accept because that's it. it yeah, because it helps us with. Spreading joy, nationalism, right? Well, I expect you in the conference room presently. Don't. Uh, General Bing. Miss the pinata. General Bing clarifies oh, registration procedure. Wasn't Prudence supposed to be coming back today. I made her a welcome back card. Prudence supposed to come back today, uh, May seventh, nineteen forty-seven. General. Ow, I got something on my knee. General Bing, the. Wait, what, what's on my knee? It's like so sensitive. I'll take a bug bite. No, I got a bug bite on my knee. Okay, let's go back. Uh, General Robert Bing, the m municipal liaison to the operation. I mean, occupation authority appeared on the parade street last late last night to speak to a crowd of citizens urgently requesting clarification of the new child registration rule. As most Wellington, Wellingtonians know by now, all children who will be under the age of 13th by July 22nd must be registered with the authority. In general, being clarified that the next deadline for registration is next Thursday. He refused to speculate on the rationale for the registration regulation. I cannot eliminate the regulation any further because Colonel von Stauffenberg has not informed me of its purpose, stated the general. So he, they, he passed it. He signed this into effect without knowing what it's going to be or its purpose. <laughs> I imagine and hope that it has something to do with maintaining the attrition of our growing children in this time of scarcity. But the OA have not told me so. Have not told me so explicitly. He reminded the crowd that the occupation has so far been extraordinarily orderly and peaceful, and that its citizens' continued obedience to legal orders of the OA is crucial to maintaining goodwill with our visiting. 
Um, is this good news? Oh, I think not. No, oh, no, I messed up. Should have stopped me there, Arthur. No, I don't want you to get your fire. It's supposed to be employees of the month. Drug trials to qualified successes, Sir Robert. This is now 1952. Yeah, this is the thing I like about George Orwell, too, is that they would alter the newspapers of the past to convince or to, I guess, gaslight people into believing that it's always been that way. Because then if people want to find evidence, they'll see the altered information. So, like, this is the way it's working here now, too, where they're just altering the history of the past in hopes that in the future, when we study it, we learn a different history, different past. Uh, the first round of trials of a new anti-melancholic -melan medication have been a qualified success. Okay, so I think this is... Oh, this is about the joy, I'm pretty sure. The drug has not been tested in human volunteers. Citizens who wish to apply as a potential volunteer, those who are already waiting lists, can do so at the Royal Victoria. This is something that we should accept. I think we can look at that. Let's go. Good history. Good history. Oh, that's it. We've done our job. It's Friday, October 9th. Okay. Let's leave. Should we close our door? Yeah. Arthur Hastings. Uh, it's 4.20 p.m. Hey, hey, let's get lit. Uh, 1964. Beauty is truth. Wellington Wells. Yeah, I still don't know what that says in Latin. I'll have to look it up. Do you the think internet network. What life's like outside the tube? Of course, he'd have to break the tube to get out. And that would break it for everybody. You're so poetic, Arthur. That is true. So all this history being altered right now. Clive. Bert Whistle. <clears throat> Can I get the papers? Clive Berth Whistle. Oh, Berth. You're off at the party. No, yeah, Bert. Can I crouch? Yeah. Ooh, let's read. No, I didn't mean to pick it up. How do I... How do I look at my inventory? Oh, I pushed N. Okay. Uh, oh, look, Miss Bing has written Clive a letter. Doctor... Doctor, dude, how can I not read? I'm getting my master's right now. I can't even read. Uh, dear Mr. Burt Whistle, it is so thoughtful of you to suggest how best to rearrange the department. I am always grateful for suggestions from junior staff of how best to do my job as director. However, I am afraid that it would be destabilizing to swap your office with that of Mr. Hastings. Oh, he wants mine. Uh, fortunately, turnover in this department is high. If Prue doesn't return soon, I don't see why you couldn't have her office. In the meantime, I suggest you pop another joy and you'll feel the sunshine on your face, whether you have a window or not. All the best, Victoria Bing, director. Oh yeah, the daughter, I'm assuming, of Robert Bing, the general. Take that, Clive, you little crap. Statistics. Cool. Search the waste bin. It's empty. Ooh, a hat. Can I take it? Can I search his files? It requires a log pick. Whoa, I jumped on accident. Read. Uh, and here's a letter in what I'm almost positive is Clive's terrible handwriting. Dear Director Bing, one of your employees is a sub subversive and may even be a downer. I overheard him in the commissary telling a friend that he thinks that his job redacting old articles is silly. And what's so scary about the truth? He is very tall and slim with black hair and brown eyes and glasses. All I know, I should have asked his name, but I am naturally a shy woman. And, and there it leaves off. A shy woman, are you Clive or just a manipulative schemer? <laughs> Aren't we that tall, dude? So he's like, talking about us, pretty much. He's talking about... Oh, shit. He wants my view. Wait, he wants my view? A shy woman, are you? I guess different pronouns? <laughs> or I'm, I'm misunderstanding it? No. He made us the devil. Or she made us the devil. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Compulsion Games, they have their own logo on that plaque. Dang, they threw a bottle at the wall. What's this line for? 
A restricted area, no unauthorized personnel beyond this point. Well, guess what? I am crossing this. Taking your power cell. No, yeah, they have Joy. Clive. Which one is Clive? Can I sit down on his chair? Oh, wait. Oh, yeah. Nice now, we're gonna we're gonna mess up their work. Farm workers expected to return from Germany. Sensor. Mm. Wait, do we want to mess them up? Or do we wanna keep them? Taxi service restored on three wheels. Memories. We're just gonna restrict it all. So that way Clive gets <clears throat> a bad performance review. What's that phase? Is that one of the developers? <laughs> um okay, Wellington under reopens. Colonel Von Stoffenberg's efficient mechanics to Wellington under will restore limited service. Well, guess what? Sensor. Arthur, are we trying to mess up Clive's work or are we trying to help them get a promotion? It's going to cause us to lose our job, man. Our office. Keep your chin up. True that. Prudence Holmes. Dang, they're... Whatever happened to you, Prudence? Their name is fading off. Come back. Hey. That's so symbolic. <clears throat> Welcome back. Fell off. So it just says come back. And we're experiencing some psychedelic episode or something. It's because the joy is wearing off. I'm pretty sure. So yeah, that pill joy is what keeps us... In a happy, uplifting mood. La la la. Rainbow, sunshine, flowers is what joy is meant to do. So if we don't take it, we see the world for how it really is. We happy few. Uh, newspapers on the ground. There's, they've been gone for a while, Prudence, because of the nasty fruit basket and such. Glad you're back. Welcome back. They're not back. Not Examine back pictures. <clears throat> Where did you go? My summer holiday. So Prudence is gone. We're good. Winner best attitude, Prudence Holmes. Simon says team tournament. <laughs> Grand prize winner. Let's go, Prudence. Professional and Simon says. Wellington Wells. Can we like do Prudence's job? Oof, they've been gone since September. Are you off your joy, Pro? I mean, you too. Oof. Let's do Prudence's job so they think that they're back. Bolshevism against Europe and Gala is smash. Well, I know that Bolshevism is something that was practiced in the Soviet Union, so let's censor that, right? I'm just going off key words that I see. What's next? Return to turn in our automotive. That's something that the people should know, right? Bring in their their cars for scrap or something. I don't know. I didn't. I didn't read it, but I'm assuming. Margaret Worthing will open, but will open Battle of Flowers. Share the meat. I don't know. I think this is it, though. Approve. Nothing to say about this, Arthur. You scolded me for getting it wrong for Clive, but not anything for Prude. Police arrest for a breeder riot. Oof. Yeah, we don't want that in the news. We don't want no no bad news on there. Okay, and that's it for us. Uh, let's dip.
Sinara. That's so gross. Ugh. Nothing. Nothing. I'm assuming if if Prudence were to leave, they would probably not bother with leaving anything behind, right? Hopkins Jones. No, no, leave me alone. I took my joy. I took my joy. No, no, leave me alone. No. <laughs> Oh, hi, Arthur. Oh, no. I don't remember seeing that. Okay, so I guess that's what happens if we don't take our joy. We'll get stabbed by... Oh, it's jammed. We'll get stabbed by somebody? No, the central processing unit. CPU. That's a weird chair to sit at. We seem to be a bit behind in our work now that you mention it. Holy crap. Is that who I think it is speaking right now? The man, the myth, the legend. Why did I jump again? The man, the myth, the legend, Uncle Jack. Let's go. Even though he is not a good guy, he is our Uncle Sam. To compare him to what he is. Oh, I guess not really. <laughs> I mean, Uncle Sam. Yeah, was used to express American dreams, not do horrific things that Uncle Jack has done. But you can see the resemblance in what they're supposed to be. Just meant to express nationalism between the people. What are you even talking about? Chip biscuits and sailors? I don't know if these power cells will be important. You know, for how much I really enjoyed this game, I don't remember much. <laughs> I keep jumping on accident. Uh, oh, I hear people having a grand old time somewhere. Hmm. Um, Okay, it's never too late to have a happy past. What was that? Oh, the file cabinet. It spooked me. The canisters, they're just making it into the bucket. The bucket isn't even lined up for that. Elevator out for lunch. The elevator is. <laughs> the conference room. Piñata, piñata, piñata. It's the most adorable Spanish custom. Uncle Jack did a whole show. I'm very familiar with it. Smash it until all the sweets come out. Come on, hit it, hit it. What are you using to hit it? What are you waiting for? Can I smack some of the? Ooh. This part makes me so uncomfortable. Ew. I already have like a, <laughs> I already have like a big fear of rats, dude. You are off your joy. Take one of mine. Oh my lord, he's a downer. Call security. We've got a downer. Oof. So joy made us see that rat as a piñata. And then off the drug, we'll see that in reality it was a rat. Oh my gosh, dude. And started eating it. Again, let me see again how we're doing at the stream. Again, let me see again. Yeah, but you mean. I was used to. That's we're good. Conference room. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. Sorry. I just like to check how we're doing because I don't want this to get messed up. But how do I climb? Oh, we just jump up again, I'm guessing. Finally, we jump. And the thing up above. Yeah, because I'm trying to get 100% on this, so I'm going to be searching for just anything. Collectibles, if anything, if there is any. Wait, did I crouch now? Oh, let's go. I crouched without even knowing that we're supposed to crouch. Okay, so there's all the canisters with the news articles. They're here? Oh! 
Uh, yeah, and I guess Downer is used to... To... Is used to describe anybody that's off the pill. Off Joy. Holy crap. We got kicked. Forget him, there's no time. They're just gonna leave me to die. <laughs> Smell gas? Yeah, let's do it. Just leave him here. Uh generating worlds. So yes, this is the only issue that I had with this game when I played. I'm starting to remember is the long loading times. Like you could be running and enter a new part of the map and it'll like put you in the screen to generate it. I mean, I guess it makes sense to have the game run smoother in, in the exact place that you need to be at. But it could be a hassle when you're trying to navigate across the map and you have to go through these waiting times a lot. So I guess it's still a thing here. Well, actually, I don't know. Maybe because it's actually going to start the game now. Since the beginning was kind of just a, like a prologue, I guess. And this is where we get more of the, the gameplay. Oh, Christ, I thought of those bastards chased me. There were bridges, weren't there? And tunnels. I'm pretty sure I'm not in the parade anymore. I don't even think I'm still in the village. In the village? That's sealed. Getting out that way. Uh, this is day one, 7.20 a.m. Find a way out. Okay, Wellington Unders, name of this mission. Barrel home distribution node. Uh, I guess we have to go that way, but let me go. I want to research and find all these cool places. Sealed. Those bobbies seem to have locked me in. I suppose they were worried about the gas. Those bobbies. Terribly thoughtful of them. <laughs> Do not. Do not open. Authorized personnel only. Oh, freaking rats, dude. Okay, I'm trying to figure out where it would be the best place to place my head in the stream. I think bottom left for now. Well, yeah, let me save game, actually, before I continue too much. So that way you guys can see on the bottom right, like, my inventory. So I don't think anything will pop up on the bottom left. I just couldn't remember where everything was going to be at for the overlay. Uncle Jack, are you here? Oh, no, I didn't even see that. Oh, yeah, there we go. Glass bottle, cloth, scrap. Take it all, I guess. Part storage. Empty bottle of joy. No! I should read instead of just picking up things anytime I see that button. What is that? Bobby pin. I'm gonna turn you off, Uncle Jack. Tie a string? Uh, to Mr. Robert Underhill, Station 4, from Jim Watt, the Chief Engineer. Uh, Dr. Rupert, are you quite certain Teddy's off his joy? Perhaps he merely forgot. You've got to look after your mates, man. Have you tried tying a string around his finger? That always helps me. Anyway, I can't resign Teddy because I haven't gotten a replacement. All the juniors are off at Scargill. The subsidence has been serving all sorts of connections and the modeling must flow i i really appreciate your sticking by your post if we don't do our duty who are we um but try the string around the finger i feel certain you will manage the situation all my best jimmy and then we got some new things too well all three you've done and you've gone and done it haven't you not only rather spectacularly quit your job but you're a downer now the townsfolk will unleash the hounds or they would if we hadn't eaten them 20 years ago gosh dang <clears throat> That's horrible. The wastrels do not seem terribly friendly. I hope they aren't really cannibals. Oh god, am I one of them now, aren't I? I've got to get out of Wellington Wells. I've got to get over the bridge and off the islands. Which means I've got to get back into the parade district, don't I? Which I was just chased out of. Brilliant. What is that question? What in dog's name were you thinking? Answer, per CSL's picture from just before we put them all on the train. God, all that horrible grinding steel and all the screams. How must How he must hate me. Why did I tell the Jerry's that I was already 13, that were only off by 10 days? Why didn't I keep my mouth shut and get on the train and go off to Germany with him like I promised him? Ah, so Arthur lied when they were, like, registering the children to do whatever. 
that there's no purpose of, that didn't find the purpose of that. Supposedly, John, General Bing didn't know what the purpose of it was. <clears throat> he just signed it into effect. But that's what he's talking about. Now, Arthur lied and told him he was 13, so he didn't have to be part of that. But his brother got whatever on the train. I can't remember, remember, but I promised him that's got to mean something. I've got to f go to find Percy, wherever he is, and make sure he's okay. P.S. How long have we been eating rats? I don't even want to know that, dude. That's so gross. Pile of coins. Can we buy stuff? I've forgotten. You can craft many things. Dirty bandage. Do I have an infection right now? I don't want to put anything on my body if it's not going to... Oh, log picks. Hold space to craft. Okay. There we go. Three years of the salamander and me getting into constant trouble finally pay off. <laughs> Nothing there. One stay second. Prudence, were you down here too? To uh, Mr. James Watt, the engineer from Rupert. He's not off his joy. He lost the plot completely and is hoarding all the carrots. He growls at me when I try to eat mine. I'm going to try to talk sense to him. Then I'm coming back to the village. Duty be damned. Cool. Point tools away from you. What? Wait, are those more bobby pins? Yeah, yeah. No, I keep taking the bottles. I don't even know what they're for. Modeline distribution something. WC, the laboratory. Somebody in the pipes? Oh, in the vents! Somebody in there that I miss? Just for to close. Drink from the tap. Wait, do we have to drink water too? Oh, Diary of Prudence. Was this a mistake? It seems so clever to disappear first rather than trying to brazen my way across the bridge after enough joy to forget that even that I'd ever known a Prudence Holmes. Beastly Clyde would take my office and they'd forget anyone else was ever in it. Wait, did she have a window? <clears throat> Gosh, I'm dying with my throat. But now that I'm here, I wonder, should I have put my trust in Mr. Kite? And where are his bloody instructions in the abandoned house? Yes, but which abandoned house? They're all abandoned. And how to deal with all these wastrels? My God, they look like something out of Dante. Would choose someone. We'd chase someone out whenever they wouldn't take their joy, but we never really thought about where they went. I knew we'd chase them out and when Joy made them sick, but I know it was here to starve and weep and remember. I assumed they were all sent to a sanatorium, a decent hospital, but I suppose that's what I wanted to believe. We are all complicit. We know without knowing and don't want to remember, so we don't. My God, I can't wait to get to the mainland. Prudence really did run off. Yeah. She ran this way. I wonder if I'll see her again. Can I take that right there? No. Mm. Sovereign? Is that money? Yummy. <clears throat> Gosh, my throat. Ugh. Do not open authorized personnel only. Is this where I just was? Oh yeah, the log pick. I've already got one. I got one. Don't worry. Oh, so that smiley face is if we're doing something illegal. No, someone's dead. What happened to him? What the who? Rupert? No, I was reading your messages, my guy. What happened to you? Oh, where to hold it? Nothing. Can I cure you? Oh, let's go, Rupert. You're coming with me. Nah, you're kind of heavy, actually, dude. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> That was a bit inappropriate. You're dead, I know. I'm sorry. An empty syringe? I guess so. Limit joy to once per hour. Gosh, people taking it twice? Twice per hour? Promises. Oh, flashback. Ralph, may go into her <clears throat> no one's going to hurt you, Percy. I, I promise. But... Have they heard the city? I don't think they'll blow anything else up. Why? 
Because we surrendered, I hope. Well, what are we going to do, Arthur? We're brothers. I'll look out for... We'll look out for each other. <clears throat> Hopefully, yeah. Wait, how did... How did Arthur sound younger than... <laughs> than... What's his face? Of Percival. Gosh, there's a lot to read. Uh, I look into the lights like the doctor's ordered. I could swear these shapes in there moving around like shadows, but made of light. And there's shadows all around, always around the corner. He keeps turning the lights off, says he wants to save the bulbs. He's trying to make me think I'm going blind, isn't he? How he loves to feel superior. Like, who is his diary of Theodore Minor? Uh, September 19th. Took two joys just so I could stay, stand his ugly face while I went to work. They swapped him up for something. Paracetamol, jelly beans. Jesus, we haven't had jelly beans since... Have we ever had jelly beans? September 20th. I hate when he talks in that slow, condescending voice like I'm a child. I'm not a child, am I? I don't even know any children, obviously. Uh, Jesus, what is wrong with my joy? September 22nd. There he is, scritching away in a corner. Scribble, scribble, scribble. Eh, Mr. Gibbon. And then the whoosh of the pneumatic tube. He's blaming it all on me what happened, isn't he? He says it's his missus. I don't believe he's got a missus. With his big mossy teeth, I bet she went on holiday long ago. Was I married once? How did it end? I get an awful feeling in my stomach. I'm not sure I'm going to enjoy remembering. Something is all effed up about the joy, and you won't send me home. We've got to stay here. Duty. September 25th, I can hear him scrunching in the dark. It isn't rats. It's his big mossy teeth. I lie awake and picture squeezing in his, his throat till he turns the color of my carrots. He bloody well stole. I'll let him try to weasel out of this one. I saw him writing those lies. Resign me, will he? Off my joy, am I? I'm bloody hell. I mean, well, tripling up and he knows it. We've come to the end of our time. Oh, Uncle Jack? That's what he says all the time. No, wrong button. We've come to the end of our time. We've come to the end of our time. Move. Hold for a full stack. Wait, how do I move things? No, my shoes are in here. Move all crafting materials to the stash. Yeah, I can still use them, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Cool. How'd it get out? Too bad I don't have any other hatches to go to just yet. Walk to another hatch. Um, something have to go in here. Locked. Requires keycard hack. <clears throat> oh yeah, that keycard reader. Control room. Oh gosh. Oh no, we're fighting. Wait, how do I fight, dude? Oh, you're the guy that's writing. Oh gosh. Okay, how do I? I'm just clicking. Oh, I'm out of stamina. Oh crap! No, please don't kill me, please. Wait, how do I defend? Oh, wet blanket. Gosh, he takes hits. I ain't gonna lie. Theodore Miner, where are you going? <laughs> no, he's gone. He's died. Can I put him with the other guy? Wait, did you kill this other guy? <laughs> I like the way their bodies fly. It's so funny. Now go in. Press a button. Turn on the radio. No. No copyright. Take all. No, what about this other one? Oh, there's a hole. Is it worth it to open that, though? I want to create like a a lock pick only for that to not be worth it. Ah, uh, he's the one that was looking at me in the vents, wasn't he? Hold on, I think that's the part we have to go to. He was a carrot that he stole. No, a man stealing carrots. So how do I get health back? Can I craft something? Is it the the dirty bandages? Where is that right there? 
No, it's only if I'm bleeding or if I'm infected. Does food help? Hold on. Oh, F. That's what I'm hitting. Oh, you have to hold it. Okay. Holy crap, so much stuff. Take it all. I ain't taking your rotten carrots, though, dude. That's gross. So this is where you've been living? Weird. Weird went that way, so let's go back. Wait, can I sleep to get health? Where's the bed? No. Wait, was it this way? Where was the bed? Ah, oh, right here to the left. Nope. Here we go. Okay, I caught top bunk. Can I get it? No. Crap. Oh my gosh. To sleep for so long. Sleep 24 hours. <laughs> sleep a whole day away. Something to drink. No, no, I'm thirsty. A pump -pump barrel hole, isn't when you consume f food, your maximum stamina increases for a short time. When you drink, the cost of sprinting is reduced. When you're too thirsty, sprinting costs more stamina. I won't die, okay. But I'll, I'll benefit. So, like, the bathroom and the sink, the water. Yummy, yummy, yummy water. I'm going drink some more. There we go. What the heck? Alright, let's go. We're so fast. Wait, wait, I didn't hit the button in there. Oh, that latch. I thought we were just supposed to walk through there. Okay. We're in a safe house right now? Bridge. I've got to get to the bridge in the parade district, which I just got in the parade district. Why did you do that with their hand? Ah, Escape Wellington Wells. Train station. If I can get to the train station, I can just follow the old rail tunnel all the way to the bridge. That looks like the sanctum where Doctor Strange that, lives. Right? I suppose back in those days we could remember where things were. Uh, travel to the train station. Pick up a rock. Weapons will break after repeated use. Ah, oh, obsess people when you carry them around openly. Cool. No, another dead body. Carolitz Thames. Nothing. No, we'll take your body and put it somewhere in a respectful location. I don't know, but I hate walking slow. <laughs> and peacetime, they'll come back. Liars. The kids? No. That reminds me of Banksy for some reason. His art. Wait, where, where are we supposed to go? That way? I don't want to explore. Look at that. See, we wouldn't find found this place if we hadn't explored. Holy crap. Watchtowers. Wait, where do we go? Rusty shovel. Wait, can we not actually go in? Oh, yeah. Anything else before we go in? Nope. Really? Couldn't climb that? Here we go. You have to hold E to climb the ladder? Man. Is that a rotten apple? Yeah. Heck nah. Pick up dig spot? Hmm. Wait, I want to get these darts. Are these weapons? People somehow never notice Arthur when he's sitting down, unless they're already engaged at him. This won't work at night, though. Okay. Is that all that's up here? Nothing else? I'm not gonna sit. Oh, no! <laughs> that's about to break my legs. Okay, I got lucky. Wait, how do I get to the dick spot again? Place waypoint? Cool. That way. Let's go. Wait, can I open this? No. 
We'll go, we'll go that way once we oh, find the dig spot. Oh, here we go. Mum wouldn't stop crying for a week. But all Percy could talk about was a train. Is that not out already? There we go. Got a flimsy cricket bat and some other crap. Man, was that worth it? Hold on, let me take off that point now. There we go. Uh, hope when the war eat less bread. We urge all housewives to grow their own vegetables. Oh, what does that say? Uh, don't let the... What? I don't know what that says. So many of those bread signs, though. Wait, can I go in there? Oh, wait, there's an opening on this side. Head boys rank. Plow boys wank. Such a cool rhyme. Best thing I've ever read. Sure, we'll take that. Holy crap, was this area bombed? See, now that also reminds me of Banksy's art. Don't let the black dog something. Wow. So symbolic, so sad. Can I check the car? There's just car. I open boot. Unlock. Nothing in there. Keep calm and carry on. Oh man, I remember seeing those signs all the time when I was younger. I think this might be the one Sally and me tried to blow up. Oh, whoa! I was what happened to the letters? There was an awful lot. Of what is that German plane? Cloth scrap. Take it in the post box. We can open the trunk on this one too. No, wrong button. It's the rock. I'm not taking that. How did I miss this? I don't read German, so I don't know what that says. Uh, something, 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 something. England. Can I get on it? No. Oh, I can. That's pretty cool, though. I mean, it sucks for the people, but <laughs> it's pretty cool. Oh, here's something. I don't know. Board it up. Oh, yeah, let's continue. Unless there's more. I mean, what is this now? The telephone? Can I call someone? We can listen. Uh, two, six bottle per bottle. I don't have a Jimmy bar. The kitchen is the key to victory. Grow your own vegetables. That's kind of cool. I like these. Propaganda posters. Wait, can I can I can't get in there? Can I climb this? Oh come on, we're doing it. Nah. Oh bloody hell. Chill out, Arthur. Chill out, dude. Oh wait, is this the entrance? I am coming for you, Percy. I haven't got it all figured out, but I will. What did it say? Don't grow. Wait, grow your own vegetables. Now enter the garden district. Wait, am I done searching? I think so. Unless there's something in this house. Am I supposed to go this way? Or am I breaking the map? No? Okay, we're good. Hello? Hello? Anybody here? What the heck? Rotting meat? Tea party? Nanny's tea party. Do come in. In your finery, remember your manners. Someone bit the tablecloth. Can I take that hat? What's the deal with the big cat, though? <laughs> okay. That's so nasty, though, that meat on the table. Oh, what is this now? Sometimes I wonder, Pinhead? Would I even recognize him? I'd be 31 now. Would he recognize me? Oh, what is this? Campfire? A branch? Where are, where are we supposed to go anyways? Oh, travel to the train station. Maybe if I read it, you know, I'd know. Uh, requires a knight to collect those? A rose of Gilead. Percy I guess we can pick these. these. For wounds and things. Heal thyself? Berries. They grow all over the Garden District, don't they? Wait, how do I do that now? Heal thyself. 
Wait, track that. I guess I can eat these till I run across a pub. How do I craft though? <laughs> Bro. Wait, I'm checking the wrong mission now. Travel to the train station. That house for sure has something inside of it. Uh, nothing. Rowanberry. Yep. Ah, oh, there it is. I see it. Doctor Strange, I'm on my way. Can we check the trunk on this one too? Nothing. How are they like already? Whoa. Join Germany and we shall fight together against communism. Wait, we're. Confused with the historical aspect of that now. Join Germany? Are we trying to join Germany now to fight against the Soviet Union? Where's that coming from? So creepy. Somebody's spying on me? I don't want that. When will they stop crying? Right here? Was the last time there was a baby in Wellington, Wales? No, China's one child policy, but taken to further extremes. No child policy. Is that what happened? There's no no children at all? I can't really remember. Ah, oh, here it is. Oh, that gave me the. Yeah, that gave me goosebumps the way you just slowed down like that. So they're faking of having children? Everything is quite all right. Nighty night, sleepy tight, everything tucked out of sight. My fair lady. <clears throat> okay. Wait, I can examine that. What's on those beds? Oh, God. I'm not the only one remembering the children, am I? Makes sense. They're all off their joy. Wait, you? so everybody just forgot about kids? That they existed? Search, nothing. Read. Uh, I'm so sorry to report that the girl spoon wouldn't eat her porridge, so I sent her to bed without supper. Weird. I've got a chest here, a sewing kit, pocket expansion kit. How do I look at that? Where is it? Use? Let's go. Wait, I don't. I've got shoes on. <laughs> <laughs> okay, and <laughs> I got shoes. Arthur, you're a weird guy. Oh, what is that? Oh, just water. Third floor. Holy crap, it just gets more and more creepy. Locked. Requires a lockpick, mechanical uh -huh. bits. But I remember how to make a lockpick. I do remember how to make a lockpick. We're doing it right now. Oh, I don't even know what that bottom thing is. The toy tea set. Funny. Where do all the mannequins come from? They didn't like anything that wasn't really the thing it was supposed to be. So many like lotso bears too. Some or something. All right, let's keep going. No, my ankles. Okay, so there really isn't much here to look at anymore. Anything else that's weird and creepy? There's a table with the weird cat at the tea party. Well, to fill up a canteen or two, shouldn't I? Some water. I'll drink more. I don't have a canteen. Am I supposed to craft one? Yo, X marks the spot. What's there? Nothing. There's just so much to explore. And that's kind of what I, what I want to do in this playthrough is just explore. No, copyright, don't listen. 
Ah, oh, that's fine. Oh, God. That's so awful in there. Wait, where is the record player? Ups upstairs? No, don't talk about your mother like that. Don't. She didn't tell you anything. I remember what we did. No, I remember. Oh God, I remember. I remember. I remember. I remember. It's on the third floor. Where are they now? All right, uh, Monday. I'm not a downer. There's no excuse for those people. I'd take joy happily if only I could. Oh God, I wish I could without puking my guts up. How could joy work for years and then currently stop? I'll clearly stop. I miss the butterflies and rainbows. Must think of the butterflies and rainbows, not the horrors that push into my head. Wow. So, person's going crazy. No, I want the bobby pins. Are this the names of different children? No, not the sideways toilet. You gotta go poop sideways. The O current? Uh, to the editor, enough with the bleeding heart editorials, the agitators that were hanging that had it coming. Gosh dang, they, they... Oh, gosh. Saboteurs swing, justice or mob violence? Holy crap. Victoria's letter? When she was here? The daughter of General Bing? I must vigorously disagree with your recent editorial regarding the vigilante action against the saboteurs. These selfish parents attempted to destroy the registry of children so that their own would not have to be hostages. Wow. Their actions were a slap in the face to every family that has sent a son off to a war. We must do we must all do our duty by long English tradition. Cowards are hanged to encourage the others. Holy crap. So yeah, they were they were hanged because they tried to not send their kids off. Or have any parents send others off? Ah, uh, who is that figure? I can't tell. Oh, there are darts on there too. No, they used him for target practice. How could we? How could we? How could we? They were so small. Oh. Oh gosh. They had each other until the end. Jeez, they hung themselves. Alexander Gilberg. Oh, oh, I feel so. Yeah, I feel so bad searching their bodies. Holy crap. Camise Griswood. Gosh, do they, they really just did that? They couldn't live to remember. So I guess that was their solution. Ah, oh, canteen. Tax. Thanks to a British, to a bit of British ingenuity, the Bilpit brothers, who were all too ill with measles to take the train last week, will be able to join their playmates after all. General Bing's office dispatched a taxi to drive a taxi, not tax, to drive the youngsters to Bristol, where they arrived just in time to board the German ocean liner, taking them to Bremerhaven. It was certainly a challenge to find their work in taxi in these times. Oh gosh, dude. Oh, that's a bit risky. Look what happened to Goldilocks. <laughs> but dang, they hung themselves out of respect. <laughs> Not like that. <laughs> Why she fall like that? Okay, um, out of respect, I'm just gonna leave them. <laughs> She's like that one picture of the little baby that's sleeping in that position too. <laughs> and like the, I saw that like, yeah, it was like a meme like the caption was when her baby dreams of their first arrest <laughs> it's really funny I know it's not funny because they they, they kill themselves but just the the position that, that she was in right there was, was kind of funny <laughs> very sad too though definitely very sad I shouldn't be laughing I shouldn't be laughing don't laugh, don't laugh, don't laugh. <laughs> okay, let's keep going, let's keep going. I'm not picking up any of your rotten crap. No, it's almost night time. Let's go to the canteen now. I mean, to the well. God, I'm famished. No, we're hungry. This ought to be pretty clean. I'm like in the village where they spike it with joy. How do you craft? 
Ah, ok. Ah, here we go. Oh, we can craft a Jimmy bar. All right, let's do that. A proper suit, healing bomb. Ah, here we go. I'll create some of these just to help me out in the future. Use the healing bomb. Okay. Oh, let's go. I knew that was going to work. It works. I feel loads better. All right, but we need food, though, dude. Travel to the train station. That's where we're going right now. Hold E to extract. I can't do that. Yo, vending machine. Nice suit. Oh, who are you, dude? My uncle bought it for me last Christmas. Anxious to get back on. Last Christmas, well, I, I gave you my heart. Well, I live in a parade. <laughs> you won't get past that door. Not without one of them disposable electrical cards that all the bobbies have. And a power cell. Now where I could mug a bobby? <laughs> You're a brave one, aren't you? No. I'll trade you one. Don't you want to go back home? <clears throat> home to all those bastards who chased me out of my house. When they all catch the plague and die. Dude, I've had my... Back. The flashlight on my phone on. Those bastards in that camp over there. With the helmets and the proper weapons. They took something from me. Very sad. I'll give you my card. Sounds quite dangerous, isn't it? Of course it's bloody dangerous. That's why I'm paying you. Come and find me. In that sort of hamlet over there. We'll trade. All right. Well, what are they? My medals. From the war. I won the DSO at Dunkirk. And the Victoria Cross at Ramsgate. Those bastards. They thought it was funny that I still had them. Fucking funny they thought it was. No, and you'll need a power cell to fire this thing up. Who'd have install most of those too? Right. Well, I'll see what I can do. Well, off I go to a Oh, wow. Fires. Just read right now the From Netflix acquired wit. the streaming rights to WWE Raw. Pretty cool, I guess, if you have Netflix and are interested in WWE. I mean, I am, and I've never been able to watch it live because I'm not going to pay for cable, but I get Netflix to my family, so maybe I'll start watching it until then. And when this get put, puts on there, I mean, put on there. No, oh, I don't want to use log picks. Find a way into the headboy camp. All that for duct tape? Come on, dude. I got more stuff out of the locker next to it than the chest. A friendly reminder to enter the village. Remove soiled garments, enjoy a tippet shower, put on tidy clothes, spritz on some scent, peppermint of roses, pop a joy, watch Uncle Jack on the telly, play a game. Don't I, don't I have power cells? Could have swore I had a power cell. Buy stuff. Oh, how much money do we have? 28 bucks oh no Drakey's twenty dollars for each gosh dang dude we'll just find something on the ground wait can we take the power cell in there oh I was about to jump off right here and died guys I need food please someone feed me I'm not gonna eat a rotten potato please Can I eat these? Oh, it worked. Okay. Cool. Yeah, people aren't happy when I put, pull that weapon out. Okay. Wait, what is this? Campfire, please have food for me. No, I don't care about your big splinters. And that's the end. <laughs> No, it took some health off of me. No, oh, what's alive. happening? It's a bloody fortress. What's happening? Oh crap! Oh, this is the watchtowers, right? That I was seeing earlier. I can sneak around it. Now entering hooligan camp. <laughs> no, not hooligan camp. 
How far down does this go? What is this? Oh, it's a bunker. That's kind of cool. Danger. I can't read what that says, but... I hear electricity warning. I mean, that's pretty cool, I guess. The, uh, the bunker. Oh, we can enter through there. Okay, let me keep exploring, though. A little explorer never hurt anybody. That's kind of cool, though. So I guess these hooligans ended up adapting to their environment and taking up this fortress that they abandoned. Headboy fight. All buttoned up. I suppose I can wait here till they throw a party for the whole neighborhood. Or find a cleverer way in. One up in the right. So come back at night? Nah, I'll just enter through the back. I don't want my health or stamina to go down and my hunger again, so I'm just gonna keep advancing. I don't think it'd be worth it to sleep until the night time because of that. Nothing on the rock. All right, so let's go in. Find David Livingstone's war medals. Find a power cell. Sally would have loved this. If we could never get in here. Sally. Cloth. Nah. The German emblem again. Wait, are we on a... Are we on a German island right now? Are we not in mainland England? Well, I guess main England's an island. <laughs> I guess like the mainland would be like, I'm trying to go through Belgium. I guess I have to take that elevator. I hope no one notices. So long, Jerry. Ah, uh, that's why the bulldog was biting the eagle, right? Gosh, we're taking an elevator. <laughs> Why are we taking this elevator? Uh, lovely day, Fred. A lovely day it is. A lovely, lovely day it is. Not. It's sort of a test. Someone who gets this far usually puts up a decent fight in the arena. I don't suppose there's some way I could be more useful to you. Yep. Alive. I don't know. Leave, I leave. Well, I can write a lovely poem. I won a prize in school. Nah. We've already got a bar. I like our jackets. <laughs> Looks like a rock band. We'll leave you there to starve. No, what is that? I have to give up my inventory? I. Let's do it. Gird thy loins for the moment of truth. For it is upon you. No, I have to fight. No, no, my homeboy, he's got no shoe. Headboy rules. You can choose which focus on. Okay. Headboy rules. For Little George's initiation, he has to win a fight, an arena fight with a tourist. No fair fighting, wastrel weaklings. Fresh meat only, haha, and steal food not looted from a dead body. Sneak into the village and steal Bobby Hat, maybe make it. The red Bobby's hat. That's a fight I like to see. Clean my leather jacket. Stop being a dull wanker. Oops, I guess little George might not be headboard material after all. Dang, you guys have advanced machinery. <laughs> you guys don't have to give me a cool nickname like that. So loud. Please help me. Help me. Help me. 
Danny Defoe. Arthur Hastings? I'm sorry. I, I don't. I don't think I know you. Of course you know me. You got me sacked from the old current. I uh. I, I don't remember that. I, I, I don't work there anymore. The you shoulder pads. The was insufficiently original. Danny Defoe. You you've lost a bit of weight. To be fair, you did copy my piece line by line. Who gives a shit? Hey, so they know each other. The newspaper's supposed to make you feel good. Nobody remembers what they read. I don't want to fight you. True you that sometimes. Shit. There's only enough food for the winners, see? Oh, we get food at the end? They going to point a stick. Oh gosh, dude. one doesn't look nearly as effective. How badly do I not want to kill good old Danny? Oof, do we want to kill him? Ooh. I don't want to kill you, Danny, but you might pick the other option. You seem pretty peed, peeved off. You have a lead pipe? Or a cricket bat? Yeah, you're for sure going to go with the other one, dude. And Danny's picked the lethal one. That's cheery. Yep. Hey, some guy. I've got great odds on you. Don't fuck it up. He's got to come on strong with that lead pipe. you got to want to block that. Oh, your cue. There you go. Ooh. Oh crap. Oh, you hit, hit it with a two piece combo. Let's go. Holy crap. Who? Oh no. Push, push. Oh, now we see the violence inherent in the system. He's deceased. Another fight, dude. I don't want to kill anymore. Two people. Equal rights, equal fights, bro. <laughs> oh no! Push her. No. Take it. It's been a real pleasure having you over. Kind of feel guilty for that. Catch you later. No, I could have thrown Danny on someone fighting me. Can I do it again? Can I do it now? Oh, it worked. It worked. <laughs> now it's like the elevator. <laughs> no, not punch the button. Okay, we completed that one. Conflict resolution. That was funny. I like that one. Let's all wish him well on his journey. Did I get my, my inventory back? Oof. Oh god. No, come on guys. Drick move. I'm just stealing your your metal stuff then. Nothing. He's deceased. You're all dead, aren't you? What do you have? No, Mimi. Yeah, we're not taking your rotten onion either, dude. How'd I... Oh, it's Crouch. Robin Pickles, no. He was Robin Pickles, I bet. <laughs> Sean Tambling Goggin. That's a long name. Man, if my name was Robin Pickles, yeah, I don't know if I'd be able to live. Wait, where, where do we go? Climb here? Yeah. It's a platformer now. Oh, it doesn't fall. 
Nobody really thought of checking that up here. Some sort of vent. I wonder if I can pry it loose. Don't I have a? Bar. Don't I have one? I just want to know the button craft. I don't have a Jimmy bar. Can I find stuff to make one with? I'm trying to remember the button to craft. I'm gonna have to search these. Um. I thought I crafted a Jimmy bar. Did I not? Oh, it has to be right here. Maybe here. No, I don't got enough metal bits. Bodies for bits and bobs of metal, aren't I? No way, I'm stuck in here forever now. Oh, right here on the floor. And there's one right there. Oh my gosh. Guys, I don't I don't open my eyes often. I saw that. I know that's all the metal bits that's on the floor. I gotta open my eyes more. Force open. Peace out. Actively trying to kill me, I ought to be on the lookout for a modeling dispenser. That chap with the bridge said I'd need a power cell. Oh crap, he's taking a, a P. Completing completing get quest guests. Oh my gosh. Throughout Wellington Wells will give you skill points. Use your skill points. To use your skill point, open the skill tree by pressing tab. Okay, so we got one now. Healthier. Notice footsteps from further away. Silently pick locks. Oh, that's a good one. You can carry more and being overburdened less. Oh wait, they cost a lot though. I only got one point. I can't even use it. The sweet dream skill. Oh, I thought I already had these unlocked. Okay, I guess this is the only one we can afford. Ah, okay, that's how it looks like if we own them. Arthur's got these. English, repressed. <laughs> Odd man out, defensive and sarcastic. No one is actively trying to kill. I better figure out how to get rid of him real quiet like. I definitely don't want a crowd. Choke him out. Oh, oh no. Struggle. No, not in the pee. Oh, gosh. <laughs> Why do you die like that? <laughs> they're. 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 The physics in this game is really funny. Actually, I'm gonna throw you in there, dude. No, not like that. I want you to fall face first. No, only his boots are in there. How do I get him? Like, just straight up? Oh, I hit the ceiling. I think if I want to be able to get him in there, I'll have to step in it myself. Yucky. He faced through the wall. <laughs> Wait, is he? He's unconscious. Okay. So when he wakes up, he'll fall. he fall in there. Well, let's drink it. Let's drink some water. There we go. Why do I care if they get mad if I'm stealing? I guess it's all right. Oh, we gotta press C to sneak while sneaking your visibility is lowered. You can also see what friends are doing. Tracing past the hooligans in this room. Cool. There's just one hooligan. Can I see him through the wall? I should have listened more to that. <laughs> Alright, German rations. I can hide in there, but not much else. Where are they? They're over there. Are you? Are there's only one? No, I don't want to cause a distraction. No, I don't want your. Give me your tea leaves, dude. No one just game to probably have like good stuff here. Just kind of like force you to walk around. Mm. Ooh, duct tape. I'm just gonna stand up real quick. And then one more super round. I think that's it. Ooh, what was that? Oh, the rotten potato, whatever it was. 
All right, we 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 good, we good. Hey, yo, what's on the poster? Remember who you're in fighting for. Well, who you're fighting for? I like the Betty Boop of this world. Crap, I didn't mean to steal that. War ration. That's it. All right, let's get out of here. Whoa, 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 whoa. Quick slots fill automatically from your inventory. Uh, yeah, hint, it's easier to move among your enemies if they're looking somewhere else. To cause the distraction, select your gadget quick slot with three and tap three again to second to a bottle. Raise the bottle with F. Uh, press and hold to aim and throw it someplace and investigate to abort this tap. Okay. I don't got anything to throw, though. Oh, right here. Again, I gotta open my eyes. <laughs> like, really, if I just open my eyes, this wouldn't be so hard. There we go. Okay, there we go. We got him out. No, please don't look at me. Turn around. Please. No, I'm just... I'm just trying to escape. That doesn't a fawn create a loud sound. What am I trying to get to? Yo, I'm stacked with bottles. Oh gosh dang! I don't think they'll see us, right? Nope. Dude's blind as a bat. Is this the way out? Why I put this away? Another glass bottle. Oh, the war medals. That's what we're trying to get for. Some scotch. Oh, crap. We do need a power cell. Toolbox. Hold up. 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 How to be sneaky? Find a power cell. Yeah, I guess this is the the main one we're trying to do right now. Can we have both flagged? No. All right, just gotta keep that in mind. Power cell, power cell, power cell. All right, let me pull these out again. Man's home is this castle, and it's not your bleeding castle. Oh, wait, why aren't you looking at where? Did they find me? Bro, I think they did find me there. The thing is, though, they, they can see the direction I'm throwing it. Oh, gosh. Oh, what are you doing? What are you doing? Back, back, I said, get back, get back, get back, get back, I said, <laughs> get back. Sorry, gosh, dude, I don't want to kill you guys. You have made me become this person. First aid kit. What 
is this? War ration scotch. No, we don't have stuff for healing bombs. There we go. I can find a power cell right modeling and pure resublimated thigh modeling. The fuel cool. of the future now. Let me get out of here. I hate to have knocked you guys all out, but y'all left me no choice. I think we got enough bottles. I see that now and watch me need some in the future. Oh, let's go. Everything I had when they jumped me. Thank you guys for having my stuff here. You guys are awesome. Right by the exit. It's as if this was all planned out already ahead of time. Oh, crap. Where are we now? So many bottles. I should probably pick them up, honestly. If they're giving me this many bottles, I should take them. Ah, oh, yes. I bet I can disappear into those bushes. Enemies don't see you if you're sneaking one of the, of the yellow flowers unless they bump into me. Okay, but they gave me the opportunity to be able to craft a healing bomb. So that is what I will do. Getting too close there, my guy. All right, how do I use it again? Yummy. I feel so healthy. All right, I should keep those out. Right? Bro, but I still want to search. Oh, nasty. Ow, oh, how it's nasty. What's here? Oh man, there's garbage. Hello, hello. I'm so I'm so lost. I need help. Please help me. Hello, are you? I'm under the water. Oh crap! It would suck if I got cornered here. Get out, please. Get out in time. Hello, hello, hello. I'm just a lost boy. Oh gosh, that guy's a light on his head. Can I take them out slowly, each one of them? I should be able to, right? Oh no, he's taking a pee. Alexander Slaymaker, no, please, Alex. I don't want to do that. You made me. You forced my hand. Yeah, we'll take that. Take that too. You guys gave me gave me so much bottles to use. Oh, what was that? All the two box. All right, so there's three more. Please just oh, yeah, hold on. Yeah, I'll carry you. Oh crap, they're spotting me. Oh, you saw me. Hey, 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 I got a stick. Did you claw me? Oh, I broke it. Oh, dude, I got a shovel now. I don't want to use this on you. Three-piece combo. Bam, bang, bang. Wait, what's her name? Hillary? <laughs> I don't think I've ever seen a guy named Hillary. No, Hillary, you you pulled my hand. You 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 made me do it. Head boys fight. Oh yeah. Search the campfire. Yeah, I'll take the branch. I'm not gonna use the shovel, dude. That's too deadly. Wait, I can't use the the branch. That's ridiculous. Should be able to use the branch. All right, open. Peace out. Peace out. Catch you on the flippity flip. I'm trespassing. Oh, not anymore.
Oh no, owls, I'm scared. Don't do anything to me, please. Oh, there's those flowers that require nighttime, right? Yeah. Yeah. Look at me now. I'm learning again. Um, we go where? This way? Rules of the Garden District? Don't steal, we have little enough as it is. You're welcome to visit, but do be sociable and have a chat. There's a nice fellow. Sleep in her own bed. Remember Goldilocks? You can eat any fruit you find except the fruit of the apple tree. The bobbles will kill you. Or the bobbies will kill you. What happened here? Uh, yes, we remember. You don't have to bloody remind us. The present is awful enough as it is. No, Jemima Gilbert. Oh, just, uh... oh, this is no stealing. Oops, sorry. Broke the first rule. Walking right in. <laughs> first thing I did was search the body. Your courage, your cheerfulness, your resolution will bring us victory. So much patriotism. Well, I guess you wouldn't really say that for the Brits, right? Nationalism. No, fellas, where are you going? Help me. I'm lost. Cursed I'm a lost boy. May not be all that welcoming. Yo. Let's try not to get killed, shall we? And not entering Edenham? Uh, Arthur... Yo, that's my name. Arthur Wellesley. Strange how everyone looks First so. Duke of Wellington. I wonder if Wells. that's just a side effect that's stuck. Let us in or let us out. F your society. Ponzi clothes. Give David Livingstone back his medals. I don't think it's through here, isn't it? Uh, hello? Anyone out there? I, I think I'm walking through the the bad Are you a tourist? part. A dress like one? Shit. Oh crap. No. Run, 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 please. Oh. You're new here, aren't you? From the parade? Yep. Yes. Well, I... How could you tell? <laughs> yeah. I'll tell you how to survive. Gosh, that was scary. Turn, you'll give me your socks. Well, that's outrageous. Your funeral? No, our socks. Why are they so angry? Because that suit you're wearing reminds them of all the jolly, proper, decent wellies who drove them out of the homes in the village. And now we're all cold and tired and starving to death. You better get a nice sharp rock and rip that to shreds. My uncle no, Christmas. he gave me it last oh, Christmas. Shreds. Shit, I hadn't thought there would be so many. Yeah, it's yeah, like a lot. It's groovy nightclub, isn't it? People get a bad batch of joy and it like flips a switch and they can't take joy anymore. Oy. So they get chased out of the village. Been a lot of bad batches lately. So what happens if I rip up my suit? They invite me over for tea and biscuits. Then they really won't give a damn what you do. So long as True you don't that. hate things that don't belong to you. Or go up and punch someone in the nose. Now you can survive the next five minutes. Cheerio. Cheerio. All right, so we got to craft a suit. Hold on. I do want to know. What control is it? Mouse and keyboard. Here we go. To craft. I want another button to craft without having to click the other stuff. B. Okay. There we go. No. My proper suit. Wait, is it equipped already? We'll have to put it on myself. It's already on me. Okay. No. My suit isn't decent anymore. Please. That pass on bedtime. How'd you know? Wait, what's your name again? Beryl and Markham. Been sleeping all right. <laughs> Oof. You're not gonna like it if I lockpick though. I don't wanna beat you. Oh, David, you're in here. What? I got your medals. You. you don't know what these mean to me. Wow. 
To know the silver's ball. To know that I fought. Probably to you fart? remember. We used to tour in those days. In 42, we threw them back in the sea. Then they came back in 43. It weren't the same. I hate to be a bother, but the card to get across the bridge? Right. Oh, of course, yeah. Sorry. Forgive an old man his memories. Well, good luck. I've got this key card. Thanks, dude. Power up the gate with the power cell. I guess I'm ready to cross the bridge. A safe. I suppose if there's something valuable in this house, it ought to be in here. Yep. Oh, workbench? No. A rock? I'm good. Scotch? So many rocks. I'm taking you guys' stuff because you're not saying anything. I don't even know what that says. I ain't gonna read all the books. Oh, that's part of the... No, it's part of the 100% challenge I want to do. Gosh, I'm about to find everything then. All those books. One out of ten, it said. I get past your bedtime. Maybe. Are you going to open the door? What are you doing? You guys have so many campfires. How do you trust it to not burn the, the ceiling? Wait, hold up. My quests. Escape. So we just walk out to escape pretty much. It's the only guys. The white outline uh, NPCs player. Now they're taking me in as one of them. Gosh, I'm crying. Don't cry. No tourists with the Illuminati eye. No, please don't cry. Now this is the part I was trying to sneak into earlier. Head, head boys steal. Alex McKenzie. Right. Wait, I'm trying to scavenge these houses now before I go to the terrain station. Is this where I came in from? It's that lady down on the floor. Yeah, okay. Whoa! They got war balloons. <clears throat> Are we still at war or something? Stop staring at me. Oh, this house right here. I already got a canteen, so I don't got to steal. Only if it seems worth it, we'll do something. Uh, Mr. Kite? Wait, who mentioned this person before? Welcome, dear. I know the house doesn't look much like... Oh! Prudence wanted to come here. Welcome, dear. I know the house doesn't look like much, but it's safe from doctors. And Bobby is no decent person from the village. Comes here. The wastrel population is swell. They try to look and behave like they do. They resent that you could take joy if you wanted to, while they cannot tolerate it. If they see you in fine clothes or smell that you've had comfort and good food recently, they will become quite agitated. Best to blend in. If they think you're an unfortunate like themselves, they'll leave you quite alone. Unfortunately, hooligans gangs have also realized that the garden district is out of the eye of the law. The head boys have a lair on the island. Do take care. I've prepared a cozy attic worm for my favorite rabbit, but she might jump around a bit to get into it. Getting away from it all 1964 edition by Mr. William Kite. Some sort of travel guide. No one travels. Which means this is something else. What the fuck? It seems to be a guide to surviving the garden district. How useful. Oh, we're but trespassing. Crap. Yeah, we're trespassing in somebody's home right now. I forgot. I don't know if I can go in there and like Knocked them out while they're laying down. They have a safe, but I can't open that. Here, I'm going to save the game here. And then try to knock them out right now. 
Maybe more books. <laughs> don't kill it, don't kill it, don't kill Arthur. Chill out, dude. Unconscious. Hey, I like the clout goggles, though. Wait, what is this? It's a door that's blocked out. Why? I forgot this is somebody's house, dude. I'm just in here jumping around. There we go. I mean, can I not climb this? Dude, we are we are parkouring. Whoa! Oh, it's a Jimmy bar. I thought it was a sword. Disposable save cracker. I only got one of those. Oh, healing bombs. This is all meant for prudence. Oh, how about the rabbit jumping around and everything? Yeah, I see why he said that. Because we have to jump to find this place. Does that mean we have to find something else to, like, continue the... To continue that, um... To continue that, uh... <laughs> the journey with Dr. or Mr. Kite. I forgot the name. Scotch will take it. Take that. We're not going to break into... Oh, but we might need to for Doctor What's-His-Face. We'll do it. Not of course, there wasn't anything of value in there. I mean, it probably was, but not of what I needed for Dr. Kite. <laughs> Good night, dude. You look so comfortable now, though. More comfortable. <laughs> Jane Oldfield. Sorry. You got two pillows? You got nasty shins. Take the teapot? No. It's a cool bike. Okay, we Audi. It was nice getting to know your guys' house a bit more. Bunk. Hi guys, I'm normal like you. Gosh, all these posters. We shall defend our island, whatever the cost may be. We shall fight on the, on the beaches. We shall fight on the landing grounds. We shall fight in the fields and in the streets. We shall fight in the hills. We shall never surrender. I wouldn't let you enjoy your dinner there, Felix. Mmm, ankles. Crap, my food is going down. War ration. That's fine. We will go now to... Crap, it's about to be daytime. No, jump over. I want some more of this. I don't know what it does, but I guess it's going to have... What are you, rowan berries? Yeah, our ro oh, these are better. Those roses of uh, Gilead or whatever. Pretty nice. Have I gone in there? Oh yeah, because baby crying and all that. So do we have everything before I continue? Let me go back to the church. If I can remember where that sat. Should be through here, right? You've got to find something to eat. I know, Arthur. This is where I came in from, right? Yeah. Looks like the war plunge right there. So if we go this way. No, I'm crashing. Here. What is that? Blue current. Whatever it's called, current. This is where the lady's dead at. Yeah. Okay. 
I don't think I searched the church fully. So I want I want to get stuff in there before we advance over to the bridge. Because I don't know if we're able to come back here. Oh. Another mask. But hold on before I get that. Anything else? Nope. How do I almost walk past this, dude? Lies. Oh, this mask is broken. What it looks like. I lied for you today at 4.15. Shh. That's not good, Percy. You're rubbish at lying. I was a good liar today. Shh. Who did you lie to? Mrs. Boyle. Mrs. Boyle? Is Percy you? older than me or am I older? Red, and, and her voice was like mom when she's angry. And I thought that you would ask me why she's angry. Why was she angry? I decided that she was angry, but I decided that she was angry because you were up in the tree next to Sally Boyle's bedroom window last night at 8.15 p.m. Oh, bloody hell. What exactly did he say? I told her that I was in the tree. Oh, Percy, that's very bad. No, Arthur, it's brilliant. Why is it brilliant? She won't make me be in trouble because I'm slow. You didn't have to do that. She told me not to do it again. So I promised I wouldn't. Thank you. I love you, Arthur. I love you too. Cool. So I'm confused if Percy is older than me. All right, catch on the flippity flip. I'm off to the bridge. I'm off to become a normal citizen again. I will thank you guys for your service. Uh, uh, I'll see you next time, Felix. Oh, uh, ankles. Peace out, homebodies. Take, take. It's one for the one in the morning. <laughs> I thought it was almost morning just because of the way it looks like. Dang. Light pollution here is just as bad. Does this count as drink, as eating? No. So I need actual food. Oh, gosh. Royston Looking Bill? What happened to you, my guy? Your legs are bleeding. Got a canteen. Let me fill that up, too. Got two canteens now filled with water. Whoa, nice sidewalk art. Wait, what is this now? Okay. I think we're good. And then this is the house with the crib again, right? Clive's got his view now. Right? Oh, this is the house with the people that hung themselves, right? Holy crap. Well, that's a convenient story, isn't it? The Germans rounded up the kids at gunpoint, did they? So much better than what we actually did, isn't it? We can examine those chalk. Those art thingies. Can we examine that? No. Yeah. She's still laying down. Dreaming of her first arrest. Okay, let's get out of here. Now for real, for real, we're out of here. Or are we yet? Any building a spot, we you know that we're gonna go in there. Or try to go in there. Alright, let's get some pedals. And let's dip. We got everything we need. I hear you, owl. Dude, it's locked. <laughs> so ridiculous. Okay, 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 okay. And then swipe. I'll hold you. Dude, I just opened the door and I still go through the window. Bloody hell. I've forgotten about the revolvers. If I go through without taking my joy, I'm going to get spanked. I better run like hell when it lets me out. Can we not? So much to choose from. We can't buy joy? I'll be back in a jiff. Crap. I'm clean. I'm clean. Please. No. Oh, 
Oh, it malfunctioned. Can I go in? And I'm off to the train station. Wait, we have to run, right? Oh, they're fake war balloons? They're actual balloons just tied down? I mean, I guess that'll fool the enemy, right? <laughs> oh, crap. What are we seeing? Oh gosh, again. This is we hang them, isn't it? They broke into the police station, tried to burn the register so the Germans wouldn't know which kids to take. We didn't want oh, the Germans, Germans to took angry. the kids. We so I thought scared. we shut them off as a country. We were just so tired. So we hanged them to encourage the others. I wonder if we'd made the Germans take the kids by force instead of bringing them down to the station singing London Bridge if things would be different now. <laughs> let it out, let it out. I hope that's the worst thing I remember. Says the they can't figure out why people are angry with you. Check your status. And select this. Why people are angry with me? Nothing. There. At least I can get on the train tracks. Then. Gosh. No, I just need to find the train station. I want to be able to see it from a distance. Yeah, so what did happen to the kids? Find hatch on Eel Peel home. Okay, but I think this is where we're going to call it. We've done quite a bit. Oh, I can't save the game? Unless it did save for me already, right? I'm just going to consider it that it did save for me. Um, but yeah, this is where I'm going to... I'm going to call it. Let me check out how this is going so far. Let me check out how it's going pretty well. Okay. Uh, thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoy this new series that I'm starting out. I really enjoy this game. This game is one of the best games I've ever played. It does seem to run better now, but I won't know until we're in further. I don't want to really spoil it, but we'll see once we get further when we can see if it'll still be annoying with those loading times. But yeah, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace out. Let me see if I can find out how to do it again on here. Okay, yeah, peace out.